I'm proud to be part of the heart failure program at Holy Cross. Over the last 16 years that I've been in practice, there has been so much evolution in heart failure medicine, from medications to devices, and we offer a full portfolio of heart failure therapies for patients who are not eligible for transplant. And one of the things we're really, really excited about is an FDA-approved therapy which uses a device called a barostimulation device. So this is a device for a select eligible group of heart failure patients who are on appropriate medicines but still have heart failure symptoms but aren't quite sick enough to be referred for transplant or left ventricular pumps. So whenever the heart muscle gets weak for whatever reason, our body tries to help out with substances like adrenaline. One of the main areas where the brain senses how much blood the heart is pumping is a natural sensor in the artery in the neck called the carotid sinus. So a barostem is a minimally invasive pacemaker-like procedure that senses a stimuli to this carotid sinus to make believe the brain that the heart is not that sick in order to minimize the damage that is caused by the adrenaline overload to the heart muscle. And so what the device does is that it actually blocks receptors which can cause the heart to feel overworked and overactivated. And by blocking that uh, response, we know that that can actually improve heart failure symptoms. So once the device is implanted, and sensing, sending the signals to your carotid sinus. We then check it and we adjust the thresholds so that we know it's working as much as you need for you. And we always still optimize the rest of your medications, the rest of your treatments. And we monitor with heart ultrasound pictures, see if your heart is getting any better, same or worse. We're really proud that we were actually part of the clinical trial to evaluate whether the therapy actually works in heart failure patients. So out of that clinical trial, which was called BEAT Heart Failure, uh, what we found is that uh, our patients who were enrolled in the trial benefited immensely from the device compared to uh, patients who did not receive the device. The, the whole point is to make you feel better, live longer, stay out of the hospital, and make your heart stronger. This is definitely an additional treatment option for selected patients. Here at Holy Cross, over the last 16 years, we've developed an enormous portfolio of therapy for patients who have heart failure. From clinical trials, to drugs, to drug titration, to cardiac exercise programs, to support groups, to devices, to emerging technologies like barostimulation. So everything short of uh, surgical therapy, such as a transplant or a left ventricular assist device, we, able, we offer it right here at Holy Cross, and we're glad to help. <laughs>